Keith, what an advert for League Two football, and that sums up Carlisle and Exeter. Yeah, I think uh, both teams, both uh, both coaches, uh, have got to take credit for putting on uh, an entertaining game um, with the the pressure of, of what's at stake. I thought both uh, both teams stuck to their guns and stuck to their principles of how they want to play the game. Uh, you'd say yeah, a very good spectacle spectacle for for both for both sets of supporters, but also then, like you said, uh, as an advert for this division, very very good. Going that test of character you've just spoken about, going two goals behind, that is a real test for anybody. Yeah, um, and again, I think the, the players deserve a lot of credit for, for the character that was shown. Um, they were challenged today. Uh, they were challenged uh, the goal, uh, with uh, three, three one down, a goal just being uh, disallowed as well. But the pleasing thing is, yeah, uh, a, mo- a moment of magic, a moment of brilliance, the magic of uh, good fortune. Uh, this place comes alive again, and you can tell what an atmosphere. As soon as we got that goal, the, the support was absolutely phenomenal. And then, and then, with that little bit of run of the green that you get, then you think you're going to get something out of this game. And to be honest, I thought at three all. Uh, I looked at the clock. There's I think it's about eight, uh, eight, nine minutes to go. I'm thinking we're going to walk out of here four three up. Um, so no, three three. Uh, you take that. I think we paid interest to. Uh, Exeter's away record and you'd probably say it's definitely their away record that has got them into the playoffs um, so we knew it was going to be a difficult test and we knew they were going to ask us quest- uh, questions uh, today the, the players show fantastic character you've said it yourself we do make it difficult for ourselves yeah um, and, and, and again we're growing we're learning there's, um, there's, uh, there's elements of the play that we still need to work on um, the players are fully aware of, aware of that uh, but the application the attention the detail the willingness uh, the desire uh, that's all all in that change room in abundance because you don't get 26 points from losing positions over the course of a season without having the without having that character and that unity the, that this football club needs uh, as a pillar and a foundation to build on. When that Harley goal went in on the stroke of half time, you must have thought, "Here we go again." Yeah, you get disappointed because you know you see the board go up and you're thinking uh, at one all we've got the ascendancy, we're comfortable. Um, if anything, you'd probably say in the balance of play, we were looking the, the slightly more dangerous team, even though they have good possession uh, how they play. But I thought we were we were matching them, uh, and we were getting close enough to them to put them under pressure. And you think, yeah, we get the next goal, we could go on and win this comfortably. Um, it's, again, it's another slap in the face that, the, that that change room took, and again, and again, what a response.